so we're here in Walmart and the dark chocolate festival is like production and we also and I also got uh variations of the chocolate we got we got peanut butter we got peanut butter uh, dark chocolate and I'm just I'm just dump it out for you. Milk crunch and wait, I got milk crunch twice. No, I thought I got uh, milk chocolate. I guess I grabbed it by mistake. And also Hershey's because I want to compare these. and see how they taste. So yeah, I got milk crunch twice, but that's the taste since I tried milk chocolate. Yeah, my dad is doing this right now. Okay, so I just got that home, dumping out the uh, chocolate. As you can see, and I already showed it in Walmart, but I'm going to show it again. Milk Crunch, and I actually bought these two by accident. So, that was a mistake. Hershey's, because I want to see if... I mean, yesterday David tried it, and he said that it tasted like Hershey's, but the aftertaste didn't taste that bad. We got... Uh, dark chocolate, and I, I know I showed it in Walmart. I know I showed it in Walmart, and also got peanut butter, which all of these uh, bars right here, I am excited about. Here they are. Oh, wait. Let me get a shot here. Here. Oh, I'm trying to do this take when I'm holding them up perfectly. Alright. Here they all are. So, yeah, I'm going to try these out one by one. And see which one tastes the best. Alright, so I have... All the feasibles right here, and I still have the wrapper for the other one from yesterday. And look at how small it is versus the other ones. I don't have the exact one, but look at how small, like how small these are. And y'all are probably wondering, where is the watch that you got? Well, if y'all remember in the birthday video, I had it. But then I gave it to David because he was begging for me to have it. So, you know, I decided to give it to him. So, first off, I am going to try Hershey's here. And I've actually uh, loved Hershey's since I was seven. And never did I know in 10 years that Mr. Beast would make a chocolate company, which I didn't even know who Mr. Beast was at the time. But um, yeah, you know, just wanted to try out the new Feasible Spar with different flavors. Alright, here's the Hershey's one right here. I'm gonna taste it. Tastes really good. Tastes like creamy feeling. But I like 
precious uh, you know this gets a 10 right here all right I need a napkin so that I don't get these dirty I was gonna put it there actually yeah I want to put it there all right so we have dark chocolate the one that I mentioned came broken so you know what it's fine I'm gonna keep all the wrappers by the way so here it is it says feasibles on here and on the inside same blocks and more pieces here of the chocolate and finally no not yet we have Mr. Beast on here. So yeah, I'm excited to try these. I'm keeping all the wrappers, so yeah, let's try where it says Fiesel. Dark chocolate tastes like all the other dark chocolate here. But that's okay. I'm gonna give some of these to my family members, see what they think. Oh. Tastes good. I give it a eight. I give it an eight. Out of ten. All right. So milk crunch. I don't think it's gonna be good as the. I mean, this might be good as the canola, but we'll see. Ooh. Oh man. Oh yeah, this is melted. I guess because I was holding it for way too long. This is what it looks like. And the back. And also here's the back for this one. Gotta check if it's still recording. Still recording. Okay. I'm not gonna suck my fingers. I just wanna put it in the um, I just want to wipe it on the napkin. Dark chocolate tastes okay. And again, this is going to be unedited, this part here. Oh man, I have some on my left hand. But it's whatever. Alright. Here's the Milk crunch. Mm. Very crunchy. Um, doesn't taste like the crunch bar, but I like it. Mm. My gosh. I'd say that this one gets a. Uh... Hold on, let me move this. Go. I give this one a. Eight and a half, 8.5. All right. 
peanut butter, <coughs> which I am like a 7 out of 10 excited for. And I haven't sniffed these yet. Ah. Oh. I already ripped it. You can see that there's peanut butter in here. Hmm. Oh, it smells like peanut butter too. There's that. All right. Hmm. Um. I haven't tried peanut butter in a long time. So this is actually new to me. I haven't tried it in over like two, three, four years. Mmm. Mmm. I love it. I love this peanut butter one here. Already ate the Miss Beast logo. Mm. I love it. I love it so much. That is a 10 out of 10, actually. I love it. Um, dark chocolate, again. Tastes like all the other dark chocolate. I said this one's sweeter, but I love it. Mm -hmm. All right. So, the winner for this, I am going to go for... I don't even know which one to choose, honestly. There's, it's, that's hard, actually. I know I said I wasn't gonna set my fingers, but I couldn't resist. So, oh God. This is a whole lot melted. That one's way crunchier than the than the crunch chocolate bar. Oh man, I'm gonna be smelling this. I'm gonna be sniffing the bar for like, I mean the wrapper for like weeks. The peanut butter definitely wins this round. And you know what? I actually like all types of chocolate. I love I love whatever types of chocolate. And, you know, this is, oh shoot, I have some in my hand. I even got some of my Adidas. So, overall, Facebook is really good. I recommend y'all that you should get it. This milk crunch is going to go to my parents. I know y'all are going to get mad in the comments, but, you know, I got to give it to my parents. Otherwise, it, imagine if I did a giveaway on chocolate, it would melt in transit. So, no. Not going to do that. I love chocolate. <clears throat> I would never say no to chocolate. 
Just like the chocolate cake that y'all saw in my birthday video, which I actually ate. Love it. So, yeah, I love whatever type of chocolate, and I will never say no to chocolate. So yeah, I'm gonna give some of the pieces to my family members and see what they think. I thought it was, I thought the video was gonna end there, but guess not. So yeah, I'm gonna give these to my parents now. Now I unfortunately couldn't get sea salt. Reason why is because I just didn't want it. I don't like salty things, so I'm sorry I couldn't get it. But again, I don't like salty things, so yeah, the salt chocolate bar is out of this list. And I was watching on the dark chocolate, and I have to remember that I'm giving these to my family members. And I'm not going to eat these for myself. So, yeah, let's see what they think. So, I didn't get my dad's reaction. But he said that it tastes very good. I gave him the dark chocolate. So, yeah, the dark chocolate uh, taste did, tasted good for him. I liked it as well. Alright, I'm gonna give these to my mom. And maybe save the rest for my father. Que sabe, mami? Sabe bien. Sabe bien. A que sabe, ah, boy. Le dices a mi tío. Y a que sabe el chocolate. Que a que... Y a que sabe. Ah, rico. Es rico. Está la chocolate, es que me va a salir. Es rico. Le gusta. Está rico. Sí. A mí también. A tu papá. Sí. So delicious. Tigre. Allí. Venga, sí. Ya está. There goes my dad. Kevin. Ya. Look at the camera. Oh, we're making a video. Yeah. All right. Oh. Uh, wait. Let's go back a bit. Okay, uh, I bought vegetables, and I have peanut butter, and I want you to tell me how it tastes. It's kind of melted. Oh, really? Is it like a new flavor, or did you just put peanut butter on there? But it's a new flavor. Why would I? How would you even do that? Oh, it's this is wrong. Yeah, you can have the peanut butter. Wait, is the camera on? Yeah, it is. How is it? Well, I thought it was going to be crunchy. No, it's this not. This is crunchy. The, what is it? Milk crunchy. This one. Even though I don't even hear the crunch. Right, it's peanut butter. No. Yes, it is. It's peanut butter. I'll have to give it a like eight eight point six out of ten. Eight point six. Mhm. Mm That's not a thing, but I'll take it. All right. Uh, we got crunch. Here. Yeah. Try that. See how that tastes. Oh, I heard the crunch. <laughs> Really wiping it on your shirt. How does it taste? Don't eat the peanut butter yet. Hmm. <clears throat> I like the crunch. How is it? 
Good. It's good. But sometimes I get the peanut stuck in my mouth, and I think it didn't happen this time. What do you rate it out of 10? I think I might give it a, a 9 out of 10. Oh, really? You said that you rated the peanut butter 8, right? Yeah. Oh, 8.6. Yeah. Okay. All right. How would you rate it? The peanut butter? 10 out of 10. How about the crunch? I said... Eight or nine out of ten. So, yeah, I think the feasible swaps are okay. Which one wins? This one or that one? The peanut butter one. Like, the peanut butter actually won when I tried it. I think I it's it. I think it's the peanut version. Why are you pointing to the? Milk crunch, whatever. Um, yeah, I love the peanut butter one, and it tasted amazing. Okay. Can I eat this entire thing? Yeah. Hey, I'm keeping the wrappers of these, just so you know. I want to put these on my wall. Wait, why don't you put it on my wall? Because I don't want to, and I want to put them in my room. So, yeah, that's my decision. Do you like feasibles overall? Yes, I like all the flavors. Mm -hmm. My favorite flavor was these nuts. Oh uh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, you that know, was good. My dad told me that he's gonna buy more grapes tomorrow, and maybe I can get us Mr. Fe Mr. Beast feasible bars, like the these nuts one. How does that sound? I don't know if they sell those no more, but we'll have to check Walmart tomorrow. Yeah. They sell them at 7-Eleven, I forgot. Wait, what? Yeah, they sell feasibles at 7-Eleven. Wow, I'm surprised. Yep. That's amazing. Mm. Hi. Alright, so... I say that the feasible stars are worth it, even though I know I, uh, I said it. And the plan for me was I wanted to cut these so that I could open these perfectly and keep the wrappers of these mint. But no, that didn't happen. So yeah, I'm fine with that. With the wrappers being torn and stuff. And I'm going to tape these on my wall up there. I don't think y'all can see it because I'm recording on my iPod. But up there so that I can get the so that I can get the wrappers on them. And I won't lie to y'all. That piece most are good. I love it. And you know I love chocolate. I would I love whatever type of chocolate but not one with like actual nuts in it like the like the Hershey's one. So, yeah, overall, I love chocolate, and I would never say no. I would never say no to any type of chocolate. I don't know why my hand was there, but... I love... I love chocolate. I love chocolate. Chocolate is my favorite snack. And I absolutely love uh, chocolate. And I'm trying to look for the receipts. I think I might have thrown it away. Because I wanted to keep the receipt for this as well. So yeah, I think I'm gonna throw away the receipt. So yeah, that's a shame. But overall, I love chocolate. I'll never say no to chocolate. Like I said, and if you want these rules, go to your local Walmart, 7-Eleven. You can go get some just about anywhere. 
fishing with the screw. I love it. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. So, oh, I got my, I got my. Uh, shorts kind of dirty. So that's pretty much it for this video. So thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later with more videos. Peace. Obviously, I'm not keeping the Hershey's one, so yeah, I just threw it away. All right, I'm gonna see if I can hang these up. And I want to hang these wrappers up somewhere, like somewhere around here maybe, or like one, two, three, four. So yeah, let's see if I can get these and I'm gonna do it off camera to save y'all some time. By the way, I'm keeping the no crunch bar, even though I know that I already have it. Right, oops, right there. I know that I already have it, but I'm gonna keep the wrapper on this anyway. So yeah, and also I found me a pair of scissors which they are right here they were in the drawer and i could never and i thought that they were upstairs but nope they're not and so yeah i found them here i found them here downstairs here so yeah that's pretty cool and here they are hung up on the wall. Some of it is coming off, which I don't like. But this was the only one that I could find. And also here's the receipt. 257 for these chocolates. FST OGN bar. So I think this, these are the prices for all the chocolate. And the Kanoa Crunch chocolate, that was 152 and I got, and I sent $2. So yeah, this was 152 at Walmart. So yeah, like I said, go get you some Feastables if you want. They taste good and I actually love Feastables, so. Yeah, if you want some, go get it. Also, if you're wondering um, what my mom said, the one who gave thumbs up, not me, um, she said that it tasted really good and she liked it. And also the guy in the red shirt. Hold on, let me find him. Oops. Oh no. I went way too far. Oh my gosh. Um this dude right here. So that is my uncle Victor and that is Abuelita Grandma Amara. So yeah. Those who uh, don't know, the guy in the red is my uncle, and that is my grandma. So, yeah, grandma and mother. So, yeah, that's who they are, in case if you're wondering.